Hello, my children. Let's read the question. The question is to be the question of H2 in terms of first standard reaction. In 15 minutes, the concentration of H2 decreases from 0 0.5 to 0 0.125 mols in one such decomposition. And the concentration of H2 reaches 0 0.05 mols during the formation of O2 will be. So the key concept here is rate of reaction. What is the reaction? By definition, it's change in concentration. What reactions per unit mole? Simple question is: If we have the reactants consume more to form products, what is the rate of reaction? For example, if we consider the decomposition of H2O2. If H2O2 and peroxide, hydrogen peroxide, decomposes to two H2O molecules in one oxygen molecule. So, in this case, question is the decomposition of H2O2 follows a first order reaction. It's the complement. So, rate of reaction is entirely dependent on the concentration of H2O2. So, clearly, the composition of oxygen the reaction and the body. So, which means rate of reaction is equal to K concentration of H2O2. That is K here. K is rate constant. The condition is that when H2O2 concentration is 0.05 mol, then the rate of formation is 0.05 mol. This can be indirectly found by calculating the decomposition of H2O2 rate. So, the rate of formation is 0.05 mol, then the rate of formation is 0.05 mol. So, the rate of formation is 0.05 mol. So, the rate of formation is 0.05 mol. So, the rate of formation is 0.05 mol. We need to find. Still, we need to find. Still, first we need to find K. Because the concentration of H two O two is given. So for that, we can use integrated rate law, which is concentration of reactant at time t is equal to initial concentration of the reactant multiplied by exponential raised to negative k t. So we are going to find that concentration of reactant at time t divided by initial concentration of the reactant is equal to Exponential raised to negative kt. This term, if we invert it, then it will be negative sign. So, exponential raised to kt is equal to concentration, initial, initial concentration of the reactant divided by concentration of the reactant at time t. Taking the natural log on the both sides. With the inverse of x, so we cancel the exponential factor, we will get kt is equal to natural log of initial concentration of the reactant upon concentration of the reactant at time t. So k will be 1 upon t and then initial concentration. Okay, concentration at time t. Another question we given here. The concentration of the H2O2 is 0 0.5 minutes. And after 50 minutes, H2O2 the concentration after 50 minutes is 0 0.125 minutes. So, so we can find this. So k will be 1 upon k, then 1 upon 15. And then initial concentration was 0 0.5 upon 0 0.125. If you calculate this, you will get ln 4 upon 15. Ln 4 k value will be approximately 1.386. So we will get k is equal to 1.386 divided by 15. By calculating this, we will get value of k somewhere about 0 0.0278 minute inverse. Minute inverse key, picking from one reaction first order here, because it is not equal to value to the cell minutes. So k may be 
is 0.0278 unit in units. इसको equation में डाल देते हैं. And we get the rate of formation, rate of decomposition of H2O2 is K. H2O2 is equal to K. Zero point zero two seven eight multiplied by zero point zero five. As you can see here, it's given. If so you calculate the integral, you will get rate of reaction, rate of decomposition of H two O two as zero point zero zero one three eight. Now we will get rate of decomposition of H two O two. So we know. Decomposition of H2O2 का reaction. So you can see two moles of H2O2 break down to get one mole of oxygen. तो यहाँ से एक basic conclusion निकाला जा सकता है कि formation है. Rate of is equal to rate of addition of H two hydrogen peroxide divided by two. So rate of formation of oxygen will be. So zero point zero zero one three eight six divided by two moles per minute. If you calculate this, you will get value somewhere about zero point zero 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 six ninety three. Calculate the other point divided by zero point zero zero. This is equal to nine eighteen to twenty six moles per minute. Which is equal to six point, which is equal to six point nine two into ten to the power negative five moles per minute. So rate of formation of O two is six point nine two into ten to the power minus two moles per minute, which is the last option. I hope you understood it. Best of luck.